Hi YouTube, it's Goddess Karma, and this is a very somber video. I'm coming to you guys today to make a confession. I, Goddess Karma, I'm a shoe addict. No though, true story, I really am a shoe addict. Um, you know everybody always goes, why do you have so many shoes you only have two feet? Why not? You have a lot of clothes. You only got one body, so why can't I have a lot of shoes? I love shoes almost as much as I love hair and, um, like, unique accessories and jewelry. Like, I'm just... One thing that I haven't gotten up on that I, I'm going to try to start paying attention to YouTube to see if anybody reviews, I am so not a... I'm so not a bag person. Like, I run bags to the ground. I love shoes, and I like buying clothes, and I like buying hair, but I run bags to the ground. Like, I don't, I don't stop rocking a bag until, you know, I may switch up if I'm, like, going to a party and I need, like, a, you know, a smaller bag, I might switch to a smaller bag, but I run like bags to the ground like when the straps are popping and there's like holes in it that's when I'll stop rocking a bag like I really run bags to the ground but anyway this is not about that this is about my Black Friday shoe haul some of them are from Shoe Dazzle some of them from local stores but I'm gonna post the links to all of them I always feel like it helps to see things up close and personal, so I don't know if these are shoes that you may have considered. You might have saw them on the site. I wanted to see what they look like up close and personal, so let me show you what they look like up close and personal. Um, the first one is Mandy, and I got this shoe. It's a um, like a a wedge booty, and I got this shoe. Um, on one of their Black Friday sales for like $14.99 after coupons and promotion codes and I'm also a VIP so the only thing I don't like about this shoe is it has this button here I guess so that if you scrunch it down but you can't really because you see how like when you scrunch it down it gets like that in the side so I guess that that oh this is real life. It's real life. You know, that's real life. That ha stuff like that happens sometimes. Back after a little um, equipment era. Um, what I was saying about this shoe is, it has this little button here, and I guess it's to like snap it back here. But you can't really invert her. Because look what happens when you invert it. It looks retarded. So I'm very confused as to why. Because if you wear it like this, you can't, you know, that button doesn't go. So I'm very confused as to why that button is even there. Like this button makes sense. I guess that's supposed to be part of the style. I, I'm very, I'm still very, very confused of what this button was supposed to do. Unless it's supposed to just like slink down, maybe, maybe it's supposed to just slink down. Maybe it's supposed to like slink down and that's what that's for. At any rate, I only paid like $14.99 for it, so I'm not, you know, not that that's like free or anything, but I, um, I'm not going to complain much. This shoe is not the best quality. I've never, I have not worn them yet, and it's already like, you know, there's some cracks in the heel right here, flaws in construction. There was a stain on it, and this is one of their final sales, so I can't even like do anything about it. But I was not impressed. Mandy looks so much more cuter on the site, and I'm gonna post a link if it's still available just in case anybody is interested it does look cuter on the site very poorly constructed look at this look at that what is that look at that very poorly constructed look at that you can see all the glue it looks like somebody wore it already it's shoe dazzle should really do better than that and that was Mandy and the tan color I was not impressed
and in the least. And I, um, you know, I love Shoe Dazzle. I'm a VIP. I order shoes very frequently from them, but I was very disappointed. Very disappointed, and that was put this in wrong. So hold on. Um, that was Mandy. Yeah, Mandy. I'm gonna cover my shoe size because I got a big old foot. But that was Mandy and Sandstone. Not the business. I did, however. I'm a VIP, and I forgot about that me being VIP, and I was the um. I think there's like classic VIP and then like premium VIP and then like the classic VIP is like um you pay like ten dollars a month and you get like free shipping on everything and um even with the free shipping on everything like the, you pay the ten dollars and they bank it for you for you to use like later so um sorry my hair is just like being bothersome right now so I had these credits. My birthday was was in December, so I decided to to buy a full price shoe, and that was Madison. Madison by Shoe Dazzle. I really like Madison. Okay, so uh, we have uh, again another snafu with the camera, um, but anyway, birthday shoe. I'll post pictures. This is Madison. Okay, Madison has a little platform. She's see-through. As you can see, she's see-through. So when you put your foot in, you would, she was completely see-through. She's absolutely comfortable. I'm not big on platforms. I would prefer, I prefer a heel with more of an indent. I don't know, for some reason I can walk longer and it lasts longer and it's more comfortable than a shoe that's like big platform. So I was able to rock this shoe all night. Bomb.com. It went with my whole little birthday ensemble. I will post the picture of her um, working it. But um, yeah. Bomb.com. Madison. I'll post the links. Madison. My last shoe dazzle shoe that I also got from their Black Friday sale was Bo Ash Announce. Bo Ash Announce in black. It's more like a pinkish shoe, I feel. And Bo Ash is a wedge sneaker. Announce. Bo Ash Announce is a wedge sneaker that I am lover, lover, loving. Um, it's like a lacy sneaker, but it's also one of the hidden wedge sneakers. It's like, I don't know how good my light is showing you. It's like a nudish color with black lace with like a nudish, like almost rose brown color. Because, you know, you could, it's like a nude rose brown color. It's not like, I guess beige. Not beige. I bought her because I kind of felt felt like on site it looked a little pinkish. Now I'm looking at it, it looks a little brown. But either way, it's a cute shoe. Especially if you love wedge sneakers. This is a, a really, really cute shoe if you love wedge sneakers. And this would be it. Okay. I haven't worn the shoe yet, but I, I'm a fan of wedge sneakers, so another type of heel that I can all night. And, uh, so that was announced. If I'm not mistaken, that shoe is still available. I don't think it was. Now, this was my backup birthday shoe that I wound up never wearing because I wore Madison and it was so comfortable and I loved it. This is un uncensored, and I got these shoes from Rainbow during their Black Friday thing. It was buy one get one fifty off, and I believe I paid thirty four ninety nine, and then the second pair was fifteen because they were both thirty four. So it was like like seventeen, and I think the the second pair was thirty, so I got it for fifteen because you know you always got to pay the higher price. So this is the shoe. It's called You. Haley in black. You Haley. 
I think it's cute, and it looks like a lot of other more expensive shoes. So I only paid thirty four dollars here in New York for this shoe. Um, really, really comfortable. It does have that little bit of a platform. I don't really like that little platform piece. I like I said, I'd rather a shoe just be flat for some reason. I I just prefer it as, as far as comfort. I just prefer that, but it's still a cute shoe. It's black. I don't have many black shoes, as as amazing as that may sound to you. I don't have a lot of black shoes. I have a lot of colors and tans and animal prints, but I don't have a lot of black shoes. So I had to get a good black shoe because Madison may be black, but she's also lace see-through. So, like, whatever you have on your foot, if you happen to wear. It's peep toe, so you might not want to, but just in case you got on some fishnets or whatever, some colored fishnets or whatever. Long story short, this is a cute shoe. You, Haley. I got this from Rainbow. So you could probably get it from, like, Rainbow, too. I get shoes from everywhere. You know, I'm a shoe person. I like to have a lot of different shoes. And it's funny because, you know, I have a friend who was talking about my shoes and telling me, oh, you don't, you don't have any red bottoms? I sure don't. I like comfortable shoes, and I heard red bottoms aren't comfortable, so I never looked into it. Plus, you know, I'm a budget fashion, fast, fashionista, you know? Um, I can't be paying $300 in some shoes. Hmm. She can't do that. This was the other pair that I got for half off because um, they were doing buy one get one fifty, and this is also uncensored. It's called Euphrenza in nude. Now me, I love a boot with a heel, so I like that this has that boot with a heel look. I love for for some reason I'm in love. I don't know. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna use the intro that I had created for all my shoe videos, but if you see my my shoe rack. I have a lot of shoes that are like booty, booties, and I love booties, especially lace-up booties. So this may not be your taste, but it's got the little things. It's very, very comfortable. Love it. And then my original birthday shoe, I never wore it because I wound up changing dresses at the last moment. Um... I got this from Charlotte Roos. She was originally 42, but I got her on like a clearance sale for like 20 bucks or 18.99. It's called Bubbles, and the color is fuchsia combo, and it is a pink hound's toe, hound's tooth shoe. Love her, love her, love it. Can't wait to accessorize her with something and rock it out rock it out I like it so again this has a really really big platform as you can see like your foot would be here so the platform is like this so it is really really tall boot tall shoe but I love pink 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 is my favorite color so this is bubbles and that was my last shoe just a little quick show and tell of what I do for Black Friday other than spend money on other people. So, hope it helped. If there was any shoes, possibly you may have been considering, I'm going to put the links down below so that um, if you were considering buying them, if they're still available, because a lot of these shoes were discounted or I got on a sale. So, you never know, Black Friday may have sold those things out. So, I will post the links below just in case they are still available. If not, you know... Thanks for watching and looking at all my pretty shoes. Bye.